What is up guys? So today I'm gonna be doing a full day of eating. This is literally the most highly requested video that I have. Out of all the videos that people request me to make, this one is the top. So I'm really excited to make this for you guys. And I just wanna share a little message before I hop into a full day of eating. Today is like so far it has not been the best like mental health day for me. The reason why is because I'm a huge perfectionist and I feel like I haven't been able to perfect everything that I want to perfect. And, you know, I had to take a step back and realize, or not realize, but acknowledge that I'm a human being and I'm not perfect and that's just what it is. My message of the day is, you are in charge of what you care about, right? So if you only care about being perfect, you're gonna miss out on so many opportunities, so many great things because you're suffering from paralysis by analysis. So you don't move because you're analyzing everything and you're not being perfect. So today I relinquish control of being perfect and I'm just gonna be me and I'm gonna be the best me. So also when I make this meal guys, my nails, I'm like currently taking them off. So I cut them and they're all jagged and stuff. So if you see that, don't even judge me because it looks like a dinosaur literally just, or an alligator just bit my nails. But anyway, I'm gonna hop straight into this video and I hope you guys like it. So the first thing I do to start my day is I start with fasted supplements. After I take my fasted supplements, I usually do fasted cardio, but today is leg day, so I don't have to do cardio. So first fasted supplement is COQ10, chromium, multivitamin, and vitamin D and also NAC. So I'm gonna take that and I'm gonna start cooking my first meal. my fastest supplements we're about to cook my first meal but another thought just came to my head <clears throat> and I wanted to talk about it I don't want any of you guys that watch my videos to feel like I don't want you guys to succumb to the pressure of like having an aesthetic physique or having like a crazy physique that you see on Instagram TikTok, and all this stuff like I understand 100% what it's like to feel like you're gonna buckle from that pressure. And I understand what it's like to be a bodybuilder and to feel that pressure from everyone that expects you to be perfect all the time or expects your physique to continue to get better. But they don't understand like that it takes a lot to get like the top tier physique, right? And sometimes you have to weigh like the pros and cons of getting a dream physique, right? And you want to have some balance in your life so you're not like fucking over everything in your life to get that dream physique. So I want you guys to know that you don't have to be perfect, guys. Like I said previously, like in the beginning of this video, you don't have to be perfect. Just be the best that you can be and don't overwhelm yourself because then you won't be able to do anything and then you won't achieve success in any way. So just take one step at a time and I promise you, you will go forward if you only take one step at a time and don't overwhelm yourself. So that's my little bit of advice. Let's go ahead and cook this first meal because I'm super hungry. <laughs> so I've been actually cooking my eggs in the microwave because I have to eat oats with them. And instead of eating the oats just plain because I can't really add anything to them, <laughs> I just cooked them with the eggs and it's been making this like cool concoction thing that I like. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. So I'm doing 30 grams of oats. I'm gonna be using muscle egg for my egg whites. 
I love mussel egg. It's literally like my favorite thing in the whole entire world. One of my favorite foods. And I got the pumpkin spice flavor. Pretty much mussel egg is just flavored egg whites. So I do 300 grams of this. Oh shit. Gonna add a little bit of cinnamon. And two whole eggs by Vital Farms. Okay, so my meal is ready. I'm about to eat it, but I have to take magnesium with this meal, so I'm gonna go ahead and grab that. Uh, fuck, I dropped it. <laughs> You guys already know what I'm about to do. Turn on Castlevania. Chill with my dino chicken nugget pillow. And eat my food. This is the life right here. This is the life. I'm not gonna lie though, prep is going by so slow. Like, <clears throat> I wish it would go by a little bit faster. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm going to eat this, watch my anime, and then I'll come back with the second meal. All right, guys, time for meal two. And it's going to be 130 grams of chicken and 100 grams of green beans. And the chicken that I use is from the chicken pound. You can use code ILEASY for 10% off. Personally, the reason why I use the chicken pound is because I do not have time or energy to be prepping my chicken. I just take it out the freezer, let it thaw out put in my air fryer for about 10 minutes and it's absolutely perfect. My favorite flavors are the jerk chicken, teriyaki, and lemon pepper. I really like that one. Or lemon herb, herb, whatever. But uh, yeah, so I'm gonna do 130 grams chicken. I think this is actually the jerk. I got some jerk here and chicken meatballs. <laughs> Perfect, I love when that happens. It literally makes my day. A perfect measurement of like chicken or any kind of thing where you don't have to cut it or like fix it or take something out, put something in. That will turn a bad day into a good day, I'm telling you guys. So, I just use the same bowl for everything. You already know, I got my mustard ready. I got my Coke Zero ready. And I'm definitely ready. I'm super hungry. So I'm gonna chow down on this and see you guys for meal number three. Alrighty guys, so it is currently time for meal number three. And I'm so excited for this. 
So meal number three is just 130 grams of chicken and cucumbers. I can do any amount of cucumbers I want, but I usually just do 100 grams. And yeah, this is my meal before my pre-workout meal. So I'm gonna go ahead and make that and I'll show you guys when I'm done. So I'm using chicken pound, chicken meatballs. Oh my gosh. 130 grams. Got meal number three here. I'm gonna get some work done on the laptop before I head to the gym. I gotta like edit some YouTube video. And look at this pretty little vase that I have with these cherry blossoms. So pretty. But yeah guys, this is the meal before my pre-workout meal. So I'm gonna go ahead and eat this. Got my mustard and yeah. Finally onto my favorite meal of the day. And that's my pre-workout meal. So my pre-workout meal, I show you guys this all the time, but I'll show you again. Gotta use the sea balm raw protein. This is the chocolate peanut butter, really good. And cream of rice. So. two minutes in the microwave well i thought this was recording but it was not but anyway i added um two grams of pink salt and 35 grams of the sea bun protein chocolate peanut butter and i'm gonna stir it all together so i've got it all mixed up i'm gonna eat this and then i'm gonna head to the gym and today is leg day so i'm really excited about that Alright guys, home from the gym. You already know what I'm gonna eat. 30 grams of cream of rice, 35 grams of whey isolate for the post-workout meal. I had to replace my battery because my battery died at the gym and that really sucked. I just used this same bowl, I don't even care. You already know. Always gotta watch Castlevania. We're gonna do 10 grams of macadamia nuts. These are the ones that I use. my last meal here salmon and cucumbers I'm not gonna add any mustard to this meal I just want to eat it like it is I've all mustard myself for the day <laughs> but yeah I'm gonna eat this and I'm gonna head to bed I hope that my full day of eating helped you guys get an understanding of what it's like to eat as a body butter and prep and as you can see, I don't have that many fats at all. I don't have that many carbs at all. Not even a gram of rice, only cream of rice. And overall, the food is really low. But this is also to show you that if you stick to your diet, you guys, you've seen my physique. If you stick to your diet, so much can change. So. If you're out there and you're trying to achieve goals when it comes to like caloric deficits, like losing weight, or maybe you're in prep for a show too, let this be your motivation. You got this, I got this. We're gonna continue to kill it, so. 
Thank you guys so much for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment if you like the video. And I'll see you guys in the next one.